culprit of course excuse me the reality with cats who was it who did it who did that hmm? is that a face of a guilty boy Anyways, welcome back to my channel. I hope that y'all are doing well. I hope that this week has been good to you because it has been actually really good to me. Um, I'm so excited to share to you guys like a couple of things that um, has happened to me this week. The good and the bad, of course. I'm gonna be showing you my night routine. Um, we actually just got home from work. We worked from like 6 p.m. until 10 p.m. As y'all know, I I am a casual like test stacker or I work with Morgan basically in the company that he's working in. I will be showing you guys what my night routine is, but disclaimer, it's not the same every day, of course. It's not gonna be the same every night. Um, definitely not perfect. Um, I'm working on um, trying to build a routine, like a, like a night routine or a morning routine. And um, we're going to be discussing a lot of things. Also, I look like a mess. So sorry. I'm going to go get some juice to relax because it is also Friday. It's going to be the weekend. Although Morgan and I are going to be working again tomorrow um, for like four or five hours and then we could enjoy the rest of the weekend. This little princess has been in the heat and we're getting her fixed on Monday. At the stack of clothes that I have to put away, I have been putting off my laundry. I mean, I have been putting off folding my laundry for like almost a week. I'm so sorry. There are just some days that I'm like, you know, if you know, you know. Also, another thing that has been added to our night routine is to give Molly her meds and her inhaler. So we're going to do that right now because it's 11 p.m. and she has to um, take her meds or else she's going to get another asthma attack. And I don't know, I feel like it's been improving. Um, 
She hasn't had any like double attacks in one day, which is really good. Of course, we give her half of um, half a tablet of her steroids. Come on, uh, open your mouth for mommy, please. Good girl, good girl. How it is? Okay, ready? Okay, one puff. Good girl, good girl, Molly. You just leave it on for 30 seconds um, until she's breathed, breathed it all in. Good girl. Of course, we have an audience. You next. You're going to have to take your steroids for your acne, little boy. So far, his acne has been pretty good. If you can see that, like under the chin, that's where the acne is. And he has to take his steroids until they finish. And of course, we like wash it with like a solution with a cotton pad and Miss Mollykins. Okay, so now it is around 11.08 p.m. Um, I have done all the stuff that I need to do, put away the laundry and then fed the cats and then as well as three as well as um giving molly her meds and now it's like my downtime and before i go to bed i try and do like something um i would write on my journal read a bit of my bible or i would crochet I'm just gonna do a little bit of check in um in my journal and so i have this journal which is um healing through words by rupi Kaur. i really love it i was never been into uh, i was never into journals I was never into journals, but um, this journal has different prompts. It's a bit on the pricey side, I think. Um, I think I got it for like, yeah, 45 almost $45. I really like this journal because the prompts aren't the same, um, if you know what I mean. Um, I've tried journaling before, but like I really didn't appreciate or I don't like the prompts. They're the same, just like... What are you grateful for today and, and stuff like that? Um, I know, uh, I'm sorry, no offense to some people who like um, that type of journal, but it's just that I want to, I love writing. This journal has brought back my love for writing. Um, I don't know, I could just like pour out my thoughts on this journal, hence why I really love it. And... Um, I currently am on the on this exercise. Um, I still have this like bookmark from the church service that we went to. Um, so yeah, currently um, I actually um, have written some stuff on this one on this um, prompt, but I want to finish it. It says set a timer for ten minutes, but I don't want to put pressure on myself and so I'm not doing the timers I don't know like I'm sorry guys um I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do it but um and it says now write down what this drawing brings up for you what was the first thing that you thought of when you observed it does the drawing have a story what is it trying to communicate so um this is a drawing this one um yeah, so take some time to examine the following drawing and then, like, do the prompt. Um, I really like it. I really love this one. And I am going to try and finish that one and then move on to the next one. And 
that is it for this video you guys I'm so sorry that it is a bit shorter than the ones that I would usually do anyways my um, pajamas are from Kmart they were from their Valentine's collection if I'm not mistaken uh, yeah we're all ready for bed um, the cats are here um, it's the three of them in this bedroom which is really good um, Celine's heat has like on down which is really good as well so we can sleep at night <laughs> and we're gonna get her fixed on Monday to fix that <laughs> to fix that issue just before I go to bed um, again disclaimer my night routine isn't the same every time of course it'll change um, also once I get a job and I have good news for you guys I actually got offered a job well I don't know if you could say that I got offered a job already but um, they're checking my references already um, and they've already asked for my pre-employment like you know records and stuff like my IDs and all those things so I'm really really hoping that I really get this job and that it is actually gonna land me a job offer but yeah thank you thank you so much guys it's around 11 55 so i am probably gonna go to bed because i have work tomorrow and i just really wanted to say that you guys are amazing that you did well this week and i hope you have a great weekend and reset for the upcoming week i will see you guys on the next one bye